Welcome back, this is Yama Jack, and today we're going to be playing Field Medic on Suicidal, yeah? I, um, I know I can do Hell on Earth as the Field Medic, but I'm just not super confident with it, especially when I'm going to be trying to go for the HOG Health Drawer. We're not doing Santa's Workshop because, like I said, I'm not super confident on Hell on Earth, and I don't really like the Santa's Workshop map. We might end up doing it anyway. Um, so this is a map I haven't played on. I played on it in KF1. But never in KF2. So I'm interested to see how it plays. Again, we're on suicidal, so it shouldn't be too, too hard as the medic. Past the first wave or so. Anyway. Hello? Also, we are going to be doing some... Uh, soon. Soon we will be doing um, online Hell on Earth. I feel pretty confident in being able to do that. We ha I haven't done Hell on Earth multiplayer in... God, just hit the stupid thing. I haven't done Hell on Earth online in uh, quite some time. So I'm excited to get into that. We might play a SWAT. Or maybe Commando. I'm not sure. I wish you weren't able to get like grabbed by Klotz and as uh, the medic. I don't think you used to be able to. A lot of people do like this quick scope thingy where they're like... You know? I don't know. I don't know if there's any practical purpose to it or if it's just kind of something that helps them with aiming. But it always looks weird when I'm watching the videos because it's just constantly like, like pop, you know? Like their accuracy is on point, but it's like, is that helping? Is that is that doing something? Is there a practical purpose to that? Because I just don't feel like there is. Like, you're not more accurate when you're scoped in, you just have, like, lower field of view. Where have you gone? Oh, is this the one that's like... There's one inside there, right? Yeah! Let's go! Uh, so to start with, we are going to pick up the SMG. Because the SMG is fine for the first little bit. Uh, and it's a great secondary weapon with the... Um, uh, incision. Or should we go for the... You know, we've done a lot of incision lately. Let's go for a different route. We're going to go for the shotgun. I'm hoping that's enough ammunition to, to get us through this round. We do also have a little bit here, which we're going to be using for some of the weaker Zeds. Just to try and see if we can make it. I don't know if my voice sounds weird, but it feels weird. I keep muting and then clearing my throat because of it. It feels like my voice sounds weird right now. I'm not sure if it does or not, but you guys will be able to tell, I suppose. It's my, uh, my morning slash I just ate slash... I don't know, something else. Plus we still have our HM tag, I guess. That's pretty cool. Okay, so this guy is what you want the shotgun for. And these guys are what you want the pistol for. This guy's also a shotgun kind of scenario. Ooh, 19 field medic. We're almost to 20. That's going to be a big help, honestly. Get out of here. Get out of here. I think we're good to just use this for everything at this point. 22 and... What's that? 51 bullets? I mean, that's plenty of bullets, so... We're probably fine. I'm excited to get back to 25. Uh, we'll play around for a bit once we hit 25 with some online field medic plays, for sure. Because I love being a, a field medic online. Um, but then we're going to be prestiging quite, uh, quite soon afterwards because I do want to, uh, first and foremost, get this up to max prestige. That just seems like a, a fun thing to do. Seems like a fun process, so I want to do it if I can. And I can. So we're gonna. I want to get all of them up to max prestige, but right now I'm working on the medic. The rest of them, you know, I have, uh, 25 commando, I think. Yeah, I have 25 commando. And I want to keep the commando at 25 because uh, 
That way I have like a powerful perk to use. What else do I have? I have 25 Commando and 25 Sharpshooter, yeah. So I can use those if I want to for something rather if I want to feel powerful still. Like Zed Time kind of gameplay, whatnot, right? I was hoping he would show me his tank so I could pop it, but my dude wouldn't do that. We're gonna pick up the uh, the assault rifle afterwards. Maybe at the end of this round. I'm not sure. We'll see. So it's a good. It's it used to be my old layout, loadout when I was playing solo field medic. It wasn't as good. Um, definitely not as good, but viable, uh, especially in suicidal. Um, Hell on Earth a little bit less so, but but definitely uh, a do. I should have bought the other weapon first, hey? That would have been the right thing to do. Okay. Um, this should be fine. Uh, we're gonna get filled up on this, and then that's just gonna suffer, I guess. That 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 should be fine, because this is just gonna get used for like maybe a scrape or uh, a flesh pound or something like that. Um, and that's enough ammunition. We're gonna. Just, I would like to have a little bit more ammunition, but I mean, even this is fine for. I know that there's the uh, the 501, which fires grenades instead, which I guess would be just better than this, but I don't know. That wasn't there back when I used to play. So, oh yeah, there's a little bit of ammo over here that'll help. I'd like armor too, if we can find it. I'm not sure where the spawns on this map are though. Oh, the spread. I'm just so not used to it anymore. I used to be able to manage the spread, like, pretty well. And now it's just, like... A mess. This is what I played before. It was solo medic like this. Quite often. Um, or at the very least... Party play. Um, so I used to be able to manage the spread... Pretty damn well, I would say. The the recoil, rather. Nowadays, it's it's definitely not as manageable for me though, because I'm used to the like nail gun or even um, Chris. We need to make sure we healed. Okay, so we do have a um, fleshy coming up. I'm going to try to enrage him over here, but we want to make sure that this dude isn't on us as well. You want uh, so we're going to be just tanking him. Popping his head. Medicine, Very simple. Uh, yeah, we're good. I probably should have just kept the shoddy up for him, hey? Maybe. Might have been a, a better idea. I mean, we have enough ammunition. Oh, I don't have two shots. We have the ammunition for kind of spraying with this at this point, so it's nice. I love the uh, the HM Tech shotgun. It's such a satisfying gun to use as the medic. I don't know. I like the the powerful weapons on medic because it makes you feel like you're you're in the I don't know. For, for roleplay purposes, it just feels good, you know? Like, yeah, I'm in the, in the heat of it all. I'm messing stuff up for these guys. I'm going to go for this ammunition, see if we can get it. I don't know, maybe it'll help us get an upgrade or something later on. We got some decent movement speed, so why not, right? I want to find some more music to put on in the background, too. I've, I've heard people getting copyright strikes because of the Killing Floor 2 music, so as much as I like it, I don't want to have it on. Um, I initially turned it off because I was just getting sick of it, um, and I wanted I just, I just wanted to listen to Windswept, so I, uh, I did. Um, but since then, I've heard people talking about having issues with it, too, so uh, we're going to go for... You don't really need that upgraded. We're going to try and upgrade this all the way. You don't really need this upgraded ever, so just going to not do it. Because, uh, you know, the thing is, this is what you're using to kill big boys, and this is what you're using to kill little boys. 
And this already does the little boys just fine, so you don't need the upgrades. I mean, uh, in multiplayer, you don't really need to upgrade it at all until maybe like the last round when everybody's rich anyway. You can just buy whatever you need. Um, but it's like... I don't know. I find a lot of medics spend a lot of money. Um, when kind of what you want to do as a medic is spend the least amount of money you can to have a capable method of keeping people alive and then after that make sure that they have money to just be able to kill things more effectively you know people that kill things don't take as much damage right when you're not able to kill stuff and you're getting y'all gotta get out of here Huh. It's a bit of a more hectic map, I guess. Because I can't see the crawlers, especially in this tall grass. God, the grass looks pretty good, though. Other than the fact that it keeps phasing in and out of existence, it looks pretty good. Maybe that's what the Z fix was for. Maybe it used to be even worse. God, that would be really frustrating. Who's attacking me? That's that's not at all. Y'all saw that, right? Like it said, I switched to this gun, and it just didn't do that. Where have we got the fleshy? Right over here. Kill him. That wasn't good head tracing. I am killing the heads, though. That oh, bloody! It feels good when you pop the head of them because you know that you were, at the very least, somewhat accurate, right? That always feels good. Feels like you're being recognized for your your hard work and dedication. Yeah. <clears throat> Got another fleshy? Goodness me. Hey, that was a pretty good takedown. That was not bad. The spread on this is really, really small. So, uh. Yeah, this has some weird recoil on it for me at this point. The spread on the, the medic shot is, is really small, it's, it's a very tight spread. Um, so it's actually got some pretty good range on it for being able to, like, hit multiple of the shots, because it's very tight. Um, thing. Now, for the boss with the shoddy, uh, could go either way. This isn't a very high damage output kind of thing, so you need to be accurate. Uh, and we all know that that's not really me, so just upgrade that. And again, what else are you going to do, right? Got all this money, you may as well spend it, right? So, Matriarch, how are we gonna fight the Matriarch? It don't matter. We just got this guy. This guy? We got this guy to kill. We gotta kill this guy. Where are you coming? Are oh, you coming up from here, hey? Where are you at, boy? I, I hear him. And I see these guys, but I don't see... I don't see him. He's gonna be like right over this hill, isn't he? Yeah. There you are. It's too bad he can't get poisoned, you know? Throw him a little bit of... Panic. That'd be nice. Try and take out his helmet. No, hello, please. I think I can get up somewhere over here. Yeah, yeah, we got we got enough time to turn around here. Just 
So that's all of our bullets for this, which is a decent amount of damage to have done, I'd say. Where is he? Let's take out the thing there. Wow, you got... Whatever, hit me. What? <laughs> what just happened? What just happened? <laughs> what? <laughs> what? <laughs> I'm gonna have to watch that one back again. Hold up. <laughs> Dude, give me a, give me an instant replay. Give me an instant replay. Hold up. Cuz cuz he was at He was, right? He he was at full. Welcome back. This is Yama Jack and um, today we're going to be playing mute. Field Medic on Audio. Suicidal. Yeah. Uh, mute. Okay, go to go to the far back. Am I recording and watching at the same time? Yeah, because you can just do that. Okay, yeah, he was at full health. And I just tanked a couple of hits from these dudes, and he just... <sighs> Oh my god! That's amazing! <laughs> I didn't end up doing the health drawer. Um, forgot about that. Oops. <laughs> but that's gonna do it for today. Thanks for watching. If you liked the video, hit the like button, subscribe to see more in the future, and I will see you next time. That kind of sounds like Northern Lights outro. I should change it up. That's okay. It doesn't matter. It's not patented. I can take it. It's mine now. <laughs> I don't know what that fight was about, but he died. <laughs> see ya. Bye-bye.